You know, normally or usually it will take eons for the Earth to, cha to change its geological structure. These new quakes could change the layout of the land in a matter of decades. We'll soon have the Giz earthquake sorted out. What if the ground cracks completely? Then my maps will com be completely useless. Outrageous! So last episode we got a big chunk of the secrets done in the game. Of polishing off, um... Uh, blanking Yarrow, um, and doing a good bit of, um, the West Temple, and even the East Temple, and this episode, depending on how much time this will take, not only will we polish off the East Temple as well, but also, uh, get started on getting toward, going towards the third and final doomsday device and uh, I'm kind of a little bit anxious on our or the state of how much money we have because um, it's either my maths has been off completely which I mean <laughs> to be honest that wasn't like at the beginning there I didn't really play too close attention um, not to mention, uh, the way I've kind of been tracking it has been... Like, I've changed the way I've tracked how much money I have, or I've, I have between episodes, um... Because I started off just by glancing at it, or like, putting the total on a notepad, um... With the rest of my session, or like, recording plan, like that sort of thing. Um, and doing the maths by brain, uh, and n now, um, I'm hoping that in between episodes, like, using, um, like a title thing for, um, thing you think is enough, and my calculator is enough, um, Either the, like either my math is way off, or um, there is simply no dialogue from Barnacle for getting 10k, but there is for I want to assume 2.5k. I mean that would make the most sense. Um, also, uh. If my maths, or like, if we do end up completely depleting all the resources, um, the best case scenario for getting around that would probably just end up being us going through and defeating a lot of the enemies, and probably using a few codmogs around. Um, I'm not really a fan of the fact that I haven't really picked anything up at the moment. Um, I think this, like, I think this is definitely going to end up being a um, cut around sort of thing because this place is big, and I really do not want to go around like spend an episode going around like doing everything. Um, hmm. So not just to mention the whole, like, lava being, like, somewhat transparent, like... The sparkle thing, like, kind of getting in the way, um... Unless I could be wrong, but I get the feeling that there is... Something in the lava... Most definitely. Um, I might go down to the inner sanctum again. That looked like a wood hole, like a like something, right? 
I'm not going insane? I saw something down there. Oh my god, really? I'm hoping this is worth, like... S okay... So that must mean there's, like, either something really big or, like... Two smaller secrets left, and I'm not entirely sure where they would even be. Um, hmm. Although... I don't think I've seen the floor down there like, much, so I'll go over there just to see if there's anything around there. Um, hmm. uh, <laughs> right. Okay. Hey, that makes a little bit more sense, the fact that there's a whole last cave down here. That we just missed! Or oh, that I just missed. Um, I think I might go touch up on some of this. Um, and as best as I can, probably try not to, to die as I go back to the thing. So I didn't put that on. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I'll go the long way, I guess. Uh... Okay, um... Okay. Crossing my fingers that we... Oh, I was right on the money and there is dialogue for this. Because it's like, either I was like, put at the end, or like, what? Okay. Oh, sorry, take it as like straight up no dialogue for that. Yeah. Um. You like, yeah, uh, now that it's on my mind, um. If. It, it, like, the thing is, like, there's a part, like, the, like, so we can just, like, fly over this completely, uh, yeah, there is a point in the game, match I think we have to go up this way, um, that is ever so slightly awkward in the fact that, um, we can get up to fighting, going up to fighting the final boss, essentially. Um, but we aren't forced into that the moment we get there, like that sort of thing. Um, but I think for a like series wise, that would just be a little bit weird in the fact that. Um, well, uh, if I want to go grind money, then that's going to be like ever so slightly weird. Okay, Temple of Destroyer, 100%. Um, so, everything or every place ex out outside of um, the Oasis and the Guidance Temple, the Temple of Guidance, uh, we have completed 100%, or we found all 100% of their secrets. Um, hmm. Yeah. Um. Like, that part's gonna be a little bit weird, but then again, um. If I don't put off the grinding for money until after that point, gonna be just ever so slightly a bit weird because, um. Not only do we have 
the uh, two caves left to go to the um final doomsday device but then we have that one final cave in Yarrow that we have to go do which will give us some secrets um I'm actually really hoping that that is the final one. Uh, I might just put that on. Um, you know what? Yeah, we we'll, may as well just go and start this point or like this now, like that sort of thing. Um, okay, we have the. Team of arrows. I'm just kind of hoping that we do get a little bit of money for doing this. Um, hmm. um, so now that we're kind of fully kit up, we don't really have to worry about anything. Um, when, like previously, I've kind of done this cave, uh, kind of jumped the gun just a little bit. Ever so slightly. Um, and we have another secret up here. Nice. Uh, yeah. Um, so the last, oh, last episode's meaningless talk was about Pokemon Skull, and I think this episode's gonna be about um, Splatoon 3 again, because like that's the only game I've been playing as of late. <laughs> Like, I really want to get around to playing like a new game or something, but I just can't move on to another game. It's like, yeah, it's always Splatoon. Like, I always come back to Splatoon 3. Um, it's kind of gotten to the point where, um, uh, it took me like two or three years to get Splatoon true to um 375 hours but it took me only four months to do the same for Splatoon 3 um although I guess you can kind of chalk that up to the fact that um Splatoon 3 is kind of like it has more and less things to do if that kind of make any if that kind of makes any sense. Um, yeah, uh, and I think at the moment, um, I've kind of just stopped worrying about like what rank I'm in in Anarchy. Although that being said, um. I did do my um calibration matches in X rank and I want to say that I might just skip I might just start doing like X rank or something and not worry about what um actual rank I I am because I had a lot of fun <laughs> with that Although that being said, I did kind of win a fair bit, um, so definitely has something to do with it. And can I check this? Yes, I can. Nice. Um, more card puzzles. Nice. Um, Will we have to use that in some way? Um. Okay. So I get the feeling that because we do or did just get Sky Sailing, we don't really have to worry about anything so much now. Or we we wouldn't have to take the long way around to get this. So that's good. Uh, yeah, um, so I think now, uh, my sort of long-term goal is probably just gonna be 
getting back to egg VP rank in Summer Run because man kind of been stuck on Profesh 3 for the longest time it's like ugh. although that being said um I would start them like I would start a shift like, oh shift session or something yeah I'll let this go first um whoa that's the last one. Well, that was a big one. This doesn't make any sense. I thought we'd be rid of the earthquakes now. Yeah, I'm sure that was the last of these devices. I've got a bad feeling about this. There are too many un unanswered questions. Doomsday colds and toxic jungles and where is Rusty? Sure is fishy. Yeah, fishy. Maybe it's not Rusty. Maybe Rosie's wrong. Or she's not telling us everything. We need to get back to the Oasis and we have to talk to Ro talk with Rosie. Yay! Yeah. Uh, yeah, um... I would start a shift session, a session of Summon Run, but then... Something would just happen and I will just end up, like, resetting. Or, like, just calling it a day, a day there. Just so I wouldn't have to, um... Reset. Say the professor's getting ready, or getting her rocket ready for blast off. I thought she was a nut, a, just a nut job, but now I'm thinking she's got the right idea. See, space is completely unexplored and ripe with new business or business opportunities. I've managed to build a new life out of nothing before, kiddo. If anything, I'm more prepared now than I was when I was younger. Still, not anything to say about that, and. Oh, splendid! You found 42 fascinating artifacts already! To show you, me, to show you my appreciation, I will hand you a blueprint for my stack. You've been so busy, I think you should. You have shown me every fascinating item on this planet. Good thing too, I don't, I don't seem to have any more blueprints. You know, that last earthquake was stupendously troublesome. Maybe if Professor Sherman is correct, we all may be forced to leave this planet. We're trying to, we're trying our very best to prevent, uh, prevent that from happening. Having to learn how to map the stars might be a wonderful challenge. Come to think of it. Okay. Um. So, uh, assuming that these are the last batch of um. Upgrades, uh, we easily have to get another, like, 40k. And I definitely get the feeling that we probably should have gotten the tier 10 backpack a lot sooner. So, I'm thinking what I'll do now is... Quickly go back through, actually, I might, um... Should be fine on like everything. Um, yeah, these. Uh, yeah. Correctly go through um, and just see if there's anything we missed, cash wise, because the fact that we need like another 3k uh, is saying something. So, I'll just go do that now. And I guess failing that, then in between episodes I'll stick my my nose to the grindstone and just try and get something. Ooh, I think down here would definitely, yeah, this is definitely gonna be it. That's something. Um, I'm gonna just have to hope that um, we'll be able to get it. Uh, okay. Uh, 
So I'm kind of hoping that mm, we have gotten the amount we need. Um, but I'm kind of thinking that for the moment, I will uh, like rearrange my layout or set up just to like kind of set up the grind mindset, like like money grinding. Um, in fact, I might even um, uh, kind of show you the optimum way of um, grinding money if we have to. Uh, actually, I'll put that off. I think we'll need it. Um. Just in case we do end up getting everything or anything. Um. But I get the feeling that most of this will be afterwards. So, like in between episodes, but I think for the moment I'll just go over the artifacts and call somewhat call it there just to see where we're standing next episode but yeah cake truth of the day there's nothing like a good cake bring your good times and you'll laughter too toy rocket follow the moon rivers with a huckleberry friend who knows what's waiting around the or waiting around the bend wagon wheel through rain and rain, and rain many southbound a small town Bots defied their fears. Most of these big city dreams of fortune and glory ended up unfulfilled, buried beneath the burning dunes of the West Desert. The way of the pioneer is always rough. But until then, that is when I'll see you.